Hi, hello, it's me, the one girl who does art videos on the internet sometimes. Lipstick on! So, I have been actively trying to improve my life. For instance, I bought sweatpants. There was a time in my life where I told all my friends, if you saw me wearing sweatpants, ask me if I'm okay, cause I'm not. But now I work from home and I don't wanna wear jeans all day and I don't wanna wear pajamas all day. And so I got some sweatpants. So in the spirit of trying new things, today on Rad Art, I want to make slime. I've never made slime. The internet and every YouTuber is obsessed with slime. I myself have watched many, many videos of little hands squishing and squatching and splotching slime stuff. And so maybe, maybe that's my jam and I just don't know about it yet. Same like sweatpants. I didn't think sweatpants were my jam, but baby, call me peanut butter. Cause I go, I go with my jam sweatpants. That was not good. So let's do it. Let's go on a journey into this world of slime. I almost have everything I need to make slime already here at this apartment, except for two things, glue and borax. So we gotta go to the grocery store. You ready? Let's go. Apparently everyone in Los Angeles is making slime today because they were out of stock of glue. They didn't have any glue. And of course they wouldn't have glue. The last two red arts didn't go quite as smoothly as I wanted them to, so I thought, well, this will be easy. I have basically every ingredient. Excuse me, Jesus, sorry. Not that kind of channel. All I need to do is go out and buy two new ingredients and then I'd be ready to go. We'd be set and awesome and make some slime and just all have a, have a giggle. But nope, that's not what God wanted today. Okay, let's see if we have glue in any of these places. This is, this is a glue gun. I've got that. We got, that's candles. What's in here? Uh, okay. Oh, that's for lino cut carving? Got that. That's not helpful today. So we've got gambling oil medium, um, a bunch of pens, don't need any of that. What's in the top bites? Um, oh, gouaches? Don't mock me. <sighs> what's up, what's up here? This is, this is just amiibos. There's a plate, a wallet, a Game Boy, some tarot cards, no glue, nope. This is charcoal, this is pencils, this is... Friendship bracelets, not today, no friends today. This is like batteries and sticky things. Ugh. A broken drawer full of wires and a controller because that's where that goes. This is old Christmas presents that didn't get to the people that they needed to go to. This, <gasps> nope, oil paint. Although I was looking for this. That's good, that's a good, no I wasn't. I wasn't looking for this at all. What's in here? Drunk Jenga, okay, well like what is, what does this say? Ew! Maybe we've got some stuff in the office. Oh yeah, that's... That's from my last job. All of this is just envelopes. Tape? Nope, tape won't make slime. Paperwork, paperwork, paperwork. <laughs> glue? Is there glue in here? What's this? Okay, this maybe we're getting someplace. This is acrylic paint. Don't know why that's in there. Gesso. You are not glue. Gloss medium? I've never used this. This is a sewing machine. This is a laptop case. This is a drill. Nothing, nothing in there. Guys, we're looking for glue. All we need today is just some glue or else I'm gonna make this without glue and we'll see how that goes. Tell me if you know anything. What's in here? Literally nothing. This was supposed to be easy. This was supposed to be the video that I bang out in three hours. Yeah, I had to make a run to Ralph's. But that was gonna be my sacrifice. Not this. Not the fact that there's no glue in this apartment. When you ain't got no glue, you gotta do what you gotta do. Oh my god! Glue from college! This is really good coffee. Okay, let's make this. Now, credit where credit is due, Charlize Morrison, her YouTube channel. That's where I got this recipe. So if you are curious how to make this, obviously I'll tell you how I'm doing it, but she does a better job because this, this video, the purpose isn't really to teach so much as it is to try. 
I'm not teaching you how to wear sweatpants. I'm just trying out sweatpants to see if it works for me. And that's how I feel about this slime situation. We have foaming soap, we have lotion, borax, cornstarch, shaving cream, food coloring, and a little silicone mixy boy. Mix a little mixy boy. We'll just like mix them, mix up your boys. First things first, borax. We need to mix one teaspoon of borax with hot water in order to get like the agent that makes things turn into slime. I didn't research any of the science. We'll see what happens. Okay, put that to the side. We will use that when the time comes. Here's a bowl that I have to put things in. First we start with our glue. This is PVA glue, which I got back in college. So it's been a couple years, but it smells fine. I have exactly a half a cup of glue in this old ass bottle of glue. The grocery store was out of glue. This is all the glue that's in my home. If this slime doesn't work out, we have no options. So there we go, I put the glue. Yes, Beth put a white liquid in a white bowl so that everybody can see. That was a good idea. It's weird to call this a recipe, but this recipe says to use one part glue to one part shaving cream to one part foamy soap. I'm doing black cherry Merlot foamy soap because I'm an adult. You can't see this. There we go, that's what we should have done from the very beginning. Why we didn't do this? Um, I don't know. It's not like I'm a professional or anything. There's a wire in the way. There we go, baby, now you can see. Now you can see so good. This looks like melted marshmallow fluff and I am into it. Now we need one tablespoon cornstarch, bing. And then my girl says to put a couple squirts of lotion in here. It's food coloring time. I think this is perfect consistency. I think, I think we're perfectly on the way to making perfect slime. I strive for perfection, which is why I'm gonna add a little bit more yellow. Yeah. Guys, the moment of truth. It is time to make dreams come true. So here's the borax and water mixture. And then here's my to be slime. Right now is just foam. We take a teaspoon at a time and we add the borax mixture into the slime. I'm gonna do two and mix that up and see what happens. Get a little bit of chunk going on here. Uh oh, guys. Nothing sliming. It's not sliming. Tell me what I did wrong. Oh no, it's not foamy anymore. I needed this to work. This is the one thing I needed to happen today. Was my glue too old? I'm YouTubing fluffy slime videos. Cause this, cause I need this. How many boraxes did you add to your slime, my lady? My sweet, sweet angel, slime princess. She put three teaspoons of borax water in there and she started to mix it. She became slime so fast. Wait, wait, oh, I think I found some slime on the bottom. What is this? Uh oh. What if I mix more borax with the water? Borax, mix. Hey, oh! <gasps> Thing. My old slime! Girl, you're gonna be okay! <gasps> Guys, slime is happening! Can I touch it? Oh, it's a little sticky. Did I do it? Did I make slime? Do you wanna hang out? You wanna hold hands? Guys, it's time to play with some slime. Ooh, baby! This is what they all do, right? I make holes in it, and then they do this thing where they pull the side in. Oh, such a successful slime I made. Look at how it holds together. Look look at how it definitely did, we did a great job. This slime is almost a good slime. And then it's, and then it just turns into this. It turns back into the liquid that it once was. Do you like this? Is this what you subscribed for? Ew. Oh no. Guys, I think I put way too much food coloring in this. That is not what I, anyone is aiming for when they're making a slime. This is like if you go on a date with somebody to a, like a cheese place 
that's a thing. And then afterwards you get a little bit of cheese food poisoning, and then you ask your date to pull over on the side of the road so you can make this on the floor. I want to slime things that I own. You know what? I'll be right back. I got something I want to slime. Like this video if you liked it. If you're not subscribed to Snarled, why not? You're missing out on all <laughs> this amazing content. If you like me and want to see more of what I do, I have a personal channel called Beth B. Rad here on YouTube, and you should check it out. Leave me a comment with what you want me to try out next time on Rad Art. And until then, let's walk away with the knowledge that if you put a ton of yellow food coloring in your slime, your hands are gonna turn yellow. Bye.